What's up guys? I'm gonna be touring an eight million dollar home here in La Jolla, right behind me, and gonna give you a tour, some information, specs, and just have, you know, a day in the life of a real estate agent. Like looking and checking out some properties for potential clients and also seeing what's on the market. So let's go check it out. So from what I know, this is a new built. They've had the property, which meaning the land. So there was nothing here for 20 years. 20 years they didn't have anything here. In the past four years, they built this beautiful property. It is listed now for $8 million, actually 7.999. And we're gonna check it out. So it is a custom home and I'll show you more about it. Just kind of some information. Too. So of course you have the security system outside. As you walk in, you have an office area. It's not a bedroom. which is pretty nice. And then what I do like about this home, the stairs, they did put some money into it. So it is called a floating stairs, which is amazing. So, and fun fact, I've, I've seen some builders do like a little tap into it and break it to make it look even nicer, like kind of like a broken glass. They do have an elevator, which is being fixed on right now. I'm gonna be honest, the furniture is pretty cool. This could be like an exercise or like a dream room with a bathroom over here as well. And then I think so that was a bedroom. This is another bedroom with a walk-in shower that is beautiful. And a bedroom over here. We are currently on the first floor. So this could be for the kids, anybody who's coming to stay here. Very nice. Hardwood. Hello. <laughs> and then we have another bedroom. Wow. I will tell you this, the furniture is beautiful. They did a really good job. This could be another game room. It is counts as a bedroom. You can have some fun play here. Another walk-in shower. That is beautiful. Wait, actually come here. Personally, I love the boxes. I think it gives like, you don't have to put things on the wall, which I love. You have a rain shower, and then you have another part where you can wash yourself. The older I get, the more I like this kind of stuff. And of course, laundry. This is pretty nice. Okay. Hello. Hello. This is a car garage. I think this is a two or a three. Three. Yeah, it's a three car garage. One here and two inside. Personally, if I lived in this property, you know what I would do with this home? What? Like with this garage, I would make it a podcast studio. What do you think? Yeah, I imagine that's a space for that. Mm -hmm. That's three. But then you wouldn't be able to. Oh, there's a door that leads. Yeah. Three car garage. I can say hi to you though. I can say hi to you. I know. What's uh? Is there a boy or girl? Oh, it's a girl. Her name is Winnie. Winnie? Yeah. Winnie. Hi, Winnie. Hi, Winnie. Do you want to say hi, baby? Do you want to say hi? Hi, Winnie. So we're gonna walk into the property right now. Is yeah, actually let's redo it. And you do have a pretty quiet street. I'm gonna be completely honest. If you don't know about this street, you will most likely not drive here. So you're not going to have a lot of people driving by. It is a public road, but and you do have public um, parking, but you most likely not see and hear a lot of people drive. So pretty quiet. And from the second floor, I think you can see the ocean. Most likely, we're going to go and check it out right now. We love it. This is Alex. This is also another agent. How are you guys? Good, good, good. Here. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so could you tell us a little bit more about the kitchen specifically? Yeah, so we have, so the kitchen is all basically built to have a consistent use of everything. Mm -hmm. So it's really easy to open the doors for storage. Uh -huh. So it's just like a tap and it opens. 
open, close. This is actually we had custom built from Italy. Wow, for wine. Very neat. <laughs> Here, of course, you're gonna have a lot of storage. And everything is uh, and everything is custom. Everything is custom. And everything works as a press of a button, basically. Wow. You have fridge, freezer. Interesting <laughs> thing that we taught here, we have both doors open up in the same way. How come? So mainly to not get stuck in the middle. Oh. And it's easier for here, if you open this way, to take this stuff and put it in the corner. Instead so of having it. Having the door mm -hmm. opening up in the other way. That makes sense. Very it's the little things that yeah. make it. It's the little things that makes, you know, yeah. sometimes the. Like so you have an outside door area with an amazing TV. I believe this is the yeah. hot too. And so, the best part, in my opinion, the selling point of this house is you have a hot tub, you have a pool, but when you are in the hot tub, you can see the ocean, which is right there. So, as we walk out, that's what I thought. I was wondering if you're going to be able to see the ocean from the second floor. Imagine waking up every single day and seeing that. Having a cup of coffee, maybe put a table here, just drink some coffee. Inside, outside. Another fun fact, in La Jolla and most cities in California, you cannot build higher homes than what they are already if you don't have the permits. So nobody's gonna build and block the view. So let me guess, there's a TV coming out here? How do you guess? <laughs> wow. Look at this building. We have our 75? 75? 75 inch uh, TV. It's actually, we have this TV everywhere. So we have this one here, mm -hmm. one outside for the outside area. Uh, and one. Looking pretty good so far. This is an office. Oh, this it's is an office. office. Yeah, it's a hidden office. It's a hidden office. Oh, that's so cool. Does this count as a bedroom? It counts as a bedroom mm -hmm. uh, mainly because of the it's right here. because of the yeah the closet. Yeah, it's not a very big one. That's why we say just an office, mm -hmm. and it's a perfect. You, know, <laughs> you could make it big enough for somebody to stay here, right? Especially like if they're traveling. Yeah, yeah. I guess. Let me show you. This is a thick door. Come here. Look at me. That's a thick door compared to other doors. Let me see. I have a half bath. Mm -hmm. Another half bath. Mm -hmm. I like the design that you guys chose. Very minimal, but pretty. So this is the whole master. And Alex, he told me that this... Where is this from? Brazil. Brazil, which is where it's he's from. My home country. Yeah. What was it still? So pretty. Oh wow. If you see from the other side, if you have the door completely closed, you don't even know where it's there. So. Or oh, whatever the back. <laughs> I've seen the glimpse. Wow. Bebe. You can open this. Bebe, forget about this. <laughs> you want to see the shower in the bathroom? Yes. This? This. This is the selling point. A little bit echoey here, but wow. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hold on. A lot of surprises. We have an alien in here. So that thing will just start working. It's heated. It's probably it's uh, it's called bidet. It's everything. Yeah, it's like a bidet on steroids. Wow. Here you're gonna find a walk-in closet. Mm -hmm. uh, we had the options to for the owner to from to do more laundry. Right? laundry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Because originally our laundry room is downstairs, but for more convenience, uh, for whoever has the primary bedroom, you know, have you have two options. What are you thinking yeah. so far? Can we live here? <laughs> In the future, yes. If you don't have clients, can we buy it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then another let's great feature that we have here, we have a door. That literally opens up over there. Mm. Look at that. 
Just in case, you know, we have rainy, rainy days, you mm -hmm. can and still have the light coming in. Oh, baby. This is unbelievable. Yeah. This might be even a better spot to have a coffee in the morning. This is beautiful. And you have still, I would say, 180 degree ocean view. Wow. You guys are seeing this for the first time. I'm seeing it for the first time. This is my reaction. This is beautiful. Eight million bucks here in La Jolla. I think this is a pretty steal. Pretty good steal. It's a pretty good deal. It's a four bedroom, five bathroom, just under 4,900 square feet. So it's big enough for a family that, you know, can host and bring some people here and there, but also enjoy the views and enjoy the California weather. We have this weather every single day. It was raining a little bit a couple of days ago, but this is an average day. And I cannot say this about a lot of other cities. Just look at the homes over here and over there behind. Oh my God. And another thing that I see, honey. Look at that. That is, I believe that's part of the house and that is solar. So I'm really curious if the solar covers the cost of the electricity of the house. So whenever you have, whenever you're building a house and you do something like this, that means you're trying to get natural light in. It's much more expensive to build, but a lot of times you do have leaks, especially in the rain. Because this is a new build, they have more regulations and you need to get more permits. So for a long time, you're not gonna have leaks, hopefully, but it's just kind of the little things that show that they went above and beyond for the next customers and they're not going to sell it for just anybody they're going to interview them just make sure there's the right person for the house because they're truly do of the house actually yeah they actually are he told me he told me that they're going to interview and just make sure that the next buyer will actually take care of the house and not trying to just sell it to anybody just make sure that it's a good family she said i like this house mama let's go Okay, let's watch. All right, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna try to upload more videos, but this is what eight, eight million bucks looks like in La Jolla. If you are looking to buy something in La Jolla or in San Diego, or you would like to see a private tour of this home, feel free to reach out to me. I'm gonna leave all my information down below in the description. And if you have any questions regarding real estate or just anything at all, feel free to reach out to me, even on Instagram. That's Vidania.